You're listening to the very 73rd episode of the Celtic Crack Podcast. No, Mikey. No, we're back on. Guess who's so, back? So, come here, as I was saying on the last episode, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine I just last continued on like that. On. <laughs> I don't know, man. Fucking hell, I can't even Jesus. remember the last episode I was on. Yeah, I can't tell. I can't remember the last episode I was, I was on either. Nuts it was nuts goofballs. It was number three or four, I think. We were on 74 now, like. <laughs> number, three, number three or four, was it, Mike? Yeah. It wasn't. It was in the 60s, I think. 69. Yeah. Were you there for 69? Ah, oh, man, I was there for 69. It was called episode 69. Ha, 69. Yeah. So it was was 69. Episode. Keep your mouth open. Um. Yeah, there was a bit of an old gap there all the same, wasn't there? That fucking got out of hand, lads. Yeah, I think, like yeah. a year and a half. And what's Jesus the blame Christ. Me for? Christ. Well, it was <laughs> mostly your fault, like, mostly. Mostly my fault for not turning up. Yeah, fucking, <clears throat> that was mad, man. That whole lockdown shit and everything hit, and it was just like, we were still doing them for a while at the start. Myself and Walshie were actually, like, just doing them on our own, and we were, like, walking here, because there was checkpoints everywhere, so we were like, fuck that, rather than try to explain to shit, I'm just doing a podcast. Yeah. So we were like, we'll just walk up to the studio and do it, and... Blah, blah, blah. And then after a while, the restrictions got worse and worse where it was actually illegal for all of us to be in the fucking room together. So we were like, ah, oh, shit, we'll wait and see how this is. Oh, How it was only it eased off now, though? Two, it was only two weeks, like, to flatten the curve. Seems like it was way longer than two weeks, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Remember they said that, it was only two weeks. Yeah, yeah. So we were like, ah, oh, we'll wait the two weeks, like. <laughs> Won't be too bad. I know some listeners will be pissed off, but it's only two weeks. Mm. Longest two weeks in the history of fucking... Weeks. Weeks, yeah. Fucking hell, man. I love what you dumped the place, Mike. Yeah, the old studio, Mike has been busy, in fairness. Yeah, yeah. All this old acoustic treatment on the wall. Yeah, yeah. Fair I'd say it sounds way better. So I wouldn't know the fucking difference. And these, I can't these, remember I, what it used to sound like. Mikey got these pictures as well. Jude hasn't even seen these. Yeah. I think they were there for the last episode, were they, Mikey? They were, yeah. I did see them on the last episode, yeah. <laughs> you weren't watching no episodes. I did see it, yeah. 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 Send nudes, we, now yourself know. Yeah, with new lighting as well. Did you get any nudes sent, Mike? I do not, so I don't have the Snapchat. Talk to Stooge. You know? <laughs> Stooge is my there screenshot. No, there's no nudes allowed on that Snapchat. Oh, yeah, you will. Oh, yeah. You're going to have milk. What's salt, eh? That's your man over with the fancy glasses. Joe has a mean? pair of glasses on, like fucking uh, Wesley Snipes from back in the day. Wesley, no, what's your man's name? Oh, that is Wesley Snipes Wesley's. and Blade, is it? Um, I don't think it was Blade, was it? There was some film anyway where he had Blade, them. It was Blade, wasn't it? Or maybe... It was he was, yeah, he was in fucking... I uh, would have said, I would have said... He was, more he was uh, in Into the West, remember that? <laughs> <laughs> Wesley Snipes. Yeah. And in, into the West. And he jack and the black horse. Yeah, inside the cinema, eating popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen that film in a yonks, man. Did you see Kevin Hart's Don't Fuck This Up, was it? Was it that? No, it wasn't. It's Kevin Hart's new film. Yeah. And I usually don't see him because I'm six foot four. Ah. Aww. Small boy. Yeah, fucking his new, his new movie that he has out. Was it a fucking... Uh, it's a series, is it? Lads can't even remember. I watched two things from him recently. I'm getting them mixed up now. But Wesley Snipes is his brother, one of them anyway. And he's fucking... Oh, looks it's completely a, it's different. It's a serious film, isn't it? It's not a comedy. Yeah. It's I kind think, of... I think I saw it advertised. He's a comedian it. in it. I think it's a series. Yeah. Can't even remember <clears throat> what it's called. Fuck me, I don't know. Whole world has gone mad, lads. <laughs> Whole world has gone mad. What about me well, finishing my washing? Yeah. Jude finished all his washing anyway and he's oh, back on the it. scene. Finish the tale about well for tonight anyway. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> <laughs> man, them glasses are fucking fab on you. Oh man, you should wear them now. Do you know when you're driving yeah. on a sunny day? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I'll what wear. you should do. Do you know you I'll drive to church on Sunday. Yeah. Do you know where you're a driver now? Shut up the place. Full license driver now. Full license driver, boy. Huh? Who won or that? You know what I mean, no, I'm messing, boy. No. Pass the test for squad now. I did, yeah. Andy. Andy. Red. I'm driving. Fucking most of my life, just never thought to get a license. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How many times did it take you, Mikey? I failed the first time. Did you? Yeah. Staying the up. first without looking behind me. Ah, you know, like, a, like a seventy-year-old man. You know the way they don't look behind them. Like a typical just... country boy, that is. Yeah, yeah, Back yeah. away till you hear the bang. Back away till you hear the bang, PJ. Yeah. Back away, there's nothing in front of you. Huh? I don't think it's a movie, though, Mike. It's a series. No, it's, it's a those. Netflix thing that. Kevin Hart joke. That Get um, Hart is a funny fucking film. Yeah. Yeah, it's all the one anyway. It was just fucking, it was the first time I'd seen Wesley Snipes in years. True story, that's it. Uh, it's fucking, it's weird because it's called True Story and Kevin Hart is in it and he plays a, a famous stand-up comedian in it. So I was like, is this actually something that really happened in his life? But then when you see the story, it's clearly not like. 
Where's Liz Snipes? He's man? just confusing people. He's Where's Liz Snipes? Agent, isn't he? Yeah. He's pushed on, all right. He's a pure fuck up in this then as yeah. well. Usually black don't crack, but he's starting to show off you. Starting to crack his mouth, all right. He is, yeah. He's starting to smoke it, it's a uh, it looks of it. <laughs> yeah. Um, what the fuck has been going on with you anyway, lads? How fuck all, life? man. All good. Fuck all, man. Give up the drink a year ago. Good. Give up the drink a year ago, huh? Give up the drink a year ago. No one improved, Joe. Fucking no one improved, boy, huh? A year and three weeks. Driving now, no. Not a year road. and three weeks. I like, a year in three weeks. <clears throat> I like to think um, I played a small part in you turning everything around and getting on the road and everything. Oh, yeah. Sure. I know I didn't, but I like to think yeah, I did. Yeah, sure. You're my sponsor. <laughs> sponsor, Joe. You're pack, my sponsor, yeah. Pack of eggs. Dr. Mikey, three screens helped you as well, but we said no more about that. Oh, yeah. Oh, I yeah. Sure we can keep on talking. I don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he helped me spiritually, yeah? Oh, helped yeah. He helped me get in touch with... Uh, helped me face some demons mm. I was fighting. Was this like a... Uh, a gay thing you did? Mm. Like I don't know about this. Lord, like, yeah. What you I, do? I, like I didn't have pants on at all. <laughs> well, you rarely do, in fairness. Uh, like. uh, he's got pants on now, but that's only for the podcast. Yeah. <laughs> Bear class slippers on as well. Bear class slippers. Yeah, yeah he actually does, slippers. mad bastard. Mike like, wearing a massive pair of slippers that are bare class. Yeah, there's that. one of them. That's the size of my head. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, Where did we even come right. across them? Yeah. Bear class slippers. Or his one. <laughs> his one. Yeah. Which are 42s. 42s? Yeah, what the fuck? Um, fabulous anyway, boys. I love what you're doing with the place. It's nice now. It's nice. Very warm in here. No, or is it just me? That's just you, man. I'm fucking roasting. Yeah, Big old, bring the big heat old tonight, hoodie on me. me. Big old hoodie. Um, what was it you had up here a minute ago, Mike? You just wanted to talk about? Ostriches. Ostriches? So a lot of, um, accept them cookies there before I fucking freak out. <laughs> Don't be accepting no cookies. There are no cookies. Oh, okay. oh this is uh, a. <clears throat> uh, I'm okay with that. Whatever. Cookies. Fucking nuisance of a thing, mate. Video shows 80 ostriches parading through the streets of a Chinese city after farm worker failed to secure the gate. Oh, man, is there a video? Lies. Don't you know <clears throat> there's going to be a virus now? The after this? brochure said there'd only be a few ostriches. Hmm. China. That's the, that's the fucking least of their problems now. Did you let one rip there, Joe? <laughs> I did, boy. You didn't again? I did, boy. Fuck that. Nobody's around same as you. Watch the way boys. Ah, stop. It's Kalili. It's sink as well, isn't it? It's fucking Kalili. <laughs> Kalili. <laughs> <laughs> that's fucking ridiculous, man. What, 80 odd ostriches running down the road. The farm was there back at the fucking farm going one, two, three. <laughs> so be 80 of them there. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Imagine seeing that like you'd be convinced you were after getting spiked or something. If you were walking down the road and you saw 80 ostriches running down O'Connell Street. Like the fuck is going on here? Time to put that fucking alcohol down. It's a... <laughs> fuck it. China. Chinese is probably opium or something he's doing. Yeah. That yeah. was very racist. Dirt, you can um. Da, 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 you can definitely eat ostriches, can you? Yeah, I told yeah. you I have steaks at home and I got them in Lidl. You were serious about that? I my life I have two steaks at home. I got I, them in Lidl. I don't know whether to believe you or not. Swear on my You've got life. ostrich steaks. Ostrich steaks. In Lidl. In Lidl, yeah. Fuck me, man. They're selling some mad things in there, no? Get fucking whatever you want inside there. Escargot. They have a big load of snails. Did I you see got them? that. I got them. I fuck, I swear to God, I thought of you straight away when I saw them. I, I was like, them. do no chance reason, them. The only reason I got them is because I never tasted them when I wanted to. No. If I got to France, I'd taste them again. I guarantee it would be no comparison, but they weren't too bad. They were just like... Snotty Snails. fucking periwinkles. Yeah, like massive periwinkles, I suppose. Yeah, but in garlic butter. They were nice, no fair. I saw them, yeah. Oh, man, it's disgusting. And mm. then they had like. I took them out with a screwdriver. <laughs> <laughs> Fill like, up not, not Nelson, the fucking house, man. Did I? <laughs> took them out with a screwdriver, eh? Imagine Joe in the kitchen with a screwdriver, eh? And fucking. That's cow gas. Snails. You've got to pick them up out in the garden for nothing. Yeah, you man. Bought them inside there's a process, little. though, because you have to. Oh, uh, what you have to do with You have to feed, only feed them carrot, and after a couple of days, then their shit will go turn orange. Ah, stop. Yeah. <laughs> then after that, then after that, then you have to freeze them for like two weeks, and they'll go into a hibernation or something like that, and then you boil the bastards. Mop said. For fuck's sake. You have to feed them carrot for a few days. Until their shit goes orange. And then freeze them, you said? And then throw them into the, throw them into the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> from into the freezer. That's lousy, man. She would freeze them when they're alive. Yeah, man. But they went to ah, sleep. She had fucking snail sleep for three years, man. Yeah. Yeah, man. Shady, and then what, shady, and what happens then? They wake up and boil them water. 
They don't. Well, they don't wake up at all. Ah, stinger. They wake up in hell. <laughs> That's sick. Yeah, they were selling. Um, what was it? Shrimps. What's the one? They're a bit uglier than shrimps. No, it's not shrimps, is it? They're big, long fucking things with like oh, legs sticking out the side of them. Kind of like a lobster, yeah. But long, skinny version. It's crayfish. a shrimp, is it? Cray- it's a crayfish. No, 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 no. Crayfish are like small lobsters. I know they're they're they're, they're shrimps, but they're different. Yeah, they're They've ugly. They've got claws, but long, skinny claws. Yeah, yeah. they look like little fucking aliens, man. They're a nice, load of them in a packet. And you're just looking at them inside in the fridge like that. Do you eat them, man? Yeah, man. But they taste like fucking periwinkles like as well. They taste like plants. <laughs> <laughs> no, I tasted... <clears throat> I they said that because like I tasted periwinkles. crabs' legs Not before. Not all seafood tastes like periwinkles, man. Crab is crabs, a decent crabs meat. Crabs' legs do taste like um, periwinkles. No, they, they fucking do, man. The one I tasted does. Oh, you were eating a periwinkle, will? Small little crab, you were eating a hermit crab out of a periwinkle shell, will you? That's what you were eating. Do you ever see the small little fucking... If you pick periwinkles, you'll get one or two fucking hermit crabs. They come out in bright red. That's yeah. what you had. I was a small crab, no, in fairness, he might have been one of them, I don't mm. know. I was only small. Yeah. How do you remember, man? Down oh, in Bally Bunyan. Down, down in Bally Bay, by the sea. Yeah. I think someone caught this crab in the water and just boiled him or whatever, and I just bit into his legs and sucked the juice out of it, and I was like, that's the very same as periwinkles. Probably just a taste of the sea or something. Yeah, salty, yeah. Yeah. Periwinkles yeah. are decent. My I'll grandmother used right to make like periwinkles sandwiches, man. Ah, stop. I swear to God. Fucking hell. And she lived till 86. Jesus. Not because of the periwinkle sandwiches, like. <laughs> she gave up the fags and she was 72. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Anything else to talk about? <laughs> I don't know, man. I forget how to do a podcast. I like, do myself, Completely man. forget. I'm actually fucking what is? nervous. Oh, yeah. oh, man, I was very nervous before this. Anxiety. Go on, having a panic attack out yeah. in the car park. Two years, if you were acting cool beforehand. I was braiding it. I was braiding into a fucking yeah. brown paper, paper bag. bag full of glue. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> Oh, man, I was like, I'm a fucking go in there and do that podcast. You should do a podcast on glue for that. Yeah. Imagine, ah, oh, stop. You wouldn't be able to, but did you ever see someone after sniffing glue? Gone. <laughs> Completely <laughs> gone. Like, you wouldn't be able to sit down and have a conversation, would you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like, ah, oh, I remember, like, fucking gas was a big one back in the day. The boy sniffing the yeah, bottles the gas, of gas. Yeah, typically. There was one of the lads around who used to always have a bottle of gas up his up sleeve. sleeve. Always. And just, and just like, you'd be talking with them, and the next thing he'd just go, yeah. <laughs> and he's gone he'd just be staring off into space <laughs> like oh, it changes oh. your voice do you hear the way it was it's like Rawr. and then you're gone but it does I don't know what it does your vocal cords you think you're talking but you're actually not yeah, just gone then zoned out yeah. of it completely the was another one man aerosols oh ah, yeah CFCs <clears throat> petrol CFCs yeah. petrols yeah be giving young lads ideas now any young lads listening to this stay away from all stay that away shit bit, kill you so fast you wouldn't even know you're dead yeah, we took it so you don't have to yeah back to tell you the story yeah it's not worth it Nah. What keep do you think on, of this, man? Keep on smoking fags. It is an original iPhone uh, 4. That's an iPhone 4. Like It, does, yeah. it seems to me like an iPhone 4 wasn't that long ago, but it was. I remember... 2011? 11, 11, 10? 11, yeah. Oh, that, oh, yeah. I had that phone in 2012. Because you got one before you went to Australia. Yeah. iPhone and 4 were, were probably 2010. And I got one. I remember I got one. One yeah. left in the bar. Snatch and run. Oh, yeah. He <laughs> 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 just found one in the pub. <laughs> Oh, lads, yeah, it was good. left on the table. Handy when you just find phones around the place, isn't it? Yeah. Like, ah, oh, you're texting nice. away there, no, as if it's got buttons. No, I'm trying to twist this around. It's the, but the home button is turned to the side. Look at this fucking size difference, man. It looks like a little tie now, doesn't it? That's not an iPhone, though, is it? Is no, it? but like compared yeah. to a phone these days. Imagine much trying to watch a film on it. Man. Yeah, look at the size of the screen on this iPhone. Like back then, we were like, man, this is class. Now it looks fucking. You picked it up there, man. I thought it was something else, like a lighter or something. It's actually a phone. It feels so weird in your hand that it's so small. Yeah. Yeah. People still use these bad boys, like. Yeah. I think they're the fucking greatest. Drug dealers. It was, yeah. That's the one I had down in Australia. Go away. You still have it. Gas, man. You fucking queer. Mikey. (laughs) (laughs) Mikey was never stuck enough where he had to sell his phone, anyway. Uh, Wait till you see the pictures that are on there. (laughs) Shall we have a look? Jesus. You'll be calling me more than queer. What's think of the one where I'm in women's knickers? Not bad. I didn't mm. know it was you. Yeah. yeah. I was just about to say something I shouldn't have said. I didn't know mm. it was you, yeah. If you keep I thought through. it was a woman because if of the lack of penis. If you keep flicking <laughs> through, my balls <laughs> pop out the side of the... <laughs> I won't keep flicking through, it's all right. No. Fuck, yeah. Uh, I'm surprised long. it can even turn on. Does it still work, Mike? It does, like, for the battery lasts about fucking 15 minutes. Ah, uh, <laughs> look at the charger. Yeah. It's one of them fucking chargers about two foot wide. 
Do you them things? That was the last one that would take that charger then they went to a smaller one yeah. and then they change again after that. Like, and I'm sure I have one of those what fucking they, chargers. They, they don't take a C-type now, do they? No, no. no. They still have their own the, charger. Uh, yeah, I think they have their own thing, yeah, don't they, they? they? The one with like a little breast bit at the front of it that you can see it looks way different than the Type C. Yeah. They're a nuisance. Now, Apple, they wreck my fucking head, by the way. They yeah. just make things awkward on purpose yeah. so that you have to buy more stuff. Yeah, yeah. Steve Jobs yeah. is a pure fraud. fraud Steve Jobs is a fraud, yeah. You see Bill Burr talking about him. He's like, everyone goes on about him like he's great. He just had a lot of smart people around him. He was like, fucking get to work. <laughs> and then, all my music inside yeah, and that yeah. by tomorrow. Get on it. Yeah, they had to figure it out. And everyone's like, Steve Jobs is amazing. Mm. Fuck that. He's great at pushing people. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know much about him. He's probably about sound. I don't know. Clue. So he's dead. How long is he dead now? I don't know. 14, is it? 13 years? 2013. Oh, no fucking hell. I can see where you got mixed up. Yeah. I didn't think it was even that long, though. Did you see Jeffrey Bezos out in a boat with his Bjor? His new Bjor? Yeah. Or she's dog ugly. <laughs> Hardly. Who's the richest man in the world now? Is it him, no? Is it him, I think. Him yeah. or, or... Someone um, keeps saying... Someone keeps saying... Certain people keep saying that uh, Elon Musk is, but he's not, is Elon he? Elon Musk is very close to them, and they share it, though. They all have too much money, anyway. Yeah, way too much. Jeffrey... Jeffrey Bezos. Uh, what's he doing? Look at this. And she had no idea paparazzi were taking pictures. Yeah. They were just doing their own thing on the board, and she pours into debt. Yeah. <clears throat> It'd be nice to have that money, wouldn't it? She's just throwing water on herself because she's so hot. Mm. Yeah. I wouldn't never like that, to have that. Never, yeah, man. That's just pure waste of water. Like, never thought of fucking herself off the boat. <laughs> yeah. You know I mean, we've got people... a planet to run, bitch. What do you think of his yacht? That's his, is that? Yeah. It's like a fucking city, isn't it? Yeah. Man, it's nicer than my bathroom. <laughs> nicer than your bathroom. <laughs> Four hundred like, million dollars. Like toilet, Mikey. It does, yeah. Four hundred million dollar flying fox yacht. That's sick, man. How in the fuck does that stay up in the water at all? I don't know. Baffling. It's like a little fucking town, man, just flying along on the water. Sick, man. Look at the little just, fucking, look just at himself tender, and his missus. Then look at little tender garage them for boats, like. Is that like a little helicopter on top of it? It is, isn't it? Is a radar yacht now? He's a helicopter there. No, there's as well, a helicopter like. pad just below that. Yeah. Right. Sick, man. That's the fella now that flew himself to space and a giant penis, wasn't it? Yeah, and he yeah, took fucking yeah. he took your man from Star Trek on, on with him as well, didn't oh, he? Oh yeah, Ooh. William Shatner. Oh William Shatner. Shatner. What was the joke about? Why was Shatner. Spock's girl from Brown because William Shatner? That's on my TikTok. Fuck yeah, hell. Oh yeah, dude, it's a pure TikTok sensation Love these it. days, no? Oh, yeah. well, TikTok or pure famous. I oh, know, yeah. Remember we used to like people on TikTok. <laughs> Did any of the mini hens complain, no? No, uh, no. They didn't know. And I should have got free food or that, man. I gave them serious too exposure. Smart. Yeah, Jude did a TikTok there about a, a shop down the road and it went a bit viral. Mm. Did you go back into the shop yet? I did, yeah, but they don't know it was me. Like. Nah. They give you free food, no? Like. You should have told them. Hmm? They give you free chicken wings or something, no? They give me nothing, man. You never told them, man. That should have been the first thing you said when you went in there. Mm. Like, how was it going? I was the fellow that made that video. Um, How much is this? I give you, you know a lot <laughs> I give you a lot of exposure. Yeah. And then you ask, how much is this anyway? What do I owe you? What and you wait I for am? them to be like, ah. What, what do I owe you? That's number 50. <laughs> what? Fold it up. Put it, put, don't tell no one yeah, I give you yeah, that. Yeah, no. yeah, yeah. Say nothing. We'll keep, this is our little secret. Put it in our pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Completely backwards. Eh? <laughs> walk away and smile and winking at the man. Yeah. Like, what the fuck After wait, massively overpaying. Like. <laughs> <laughs> massively overpaying when you expected it for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Just people don't understand how haggling works like Peter Griffin. <laughs> you walk out of there then go, ah, sucker, I would have given him 70. <laughs> <laughs> and sitting there, ah, he did a fucking video, put us on the map, boy, and then he came in and gave me money. Mm. He's a really nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> I like or him. Or a retard one. I like, I like him very much, dude. Oh, man. <clears throat> what was the story with uh, Drake during the week? Did you hear this one? Have you uh -huh. seen this? Have you heard about this? No. Drake. Ah, lads. Like, this is mad on a, a few different levels. Drake was with, he met some Instagram model. I don't know, what, whatever the fuck. He met her out somewhere or whatever anyway and brought her back to his gaff or his hotel room. And uh, apparently he asked her if he, she wanted to have sex. And she said, yeah, they made a point of that. Like, so he, he, he was consensual. He had consensual sex with this model. He wore a condom, went into the bathroom afterwards and disposed of it or whatever and then went about his business she went into the bathroom then and then he heard her screaming inside he went in and it turned out that she had taken the condom out of the bin and 
inserted it into herself and tried to pour his semen into herself to impregnate herself. But when Drake went into the bathroom, he took out some hot sauce and poured it into the condom and threw it in the fucking bin to destroy the sperm. And like, I suppose, I don't know if he did it with the intention of fucking her up, but he did it with the intention of destroying the sperm anyway. Genius. So he once started screaming anyway. And uh, yeah, and then... Uh, <laughs> murder. That's, that's, and then, that's homicide in the eyes of the law, <laughs> yeah. man. But then um, apparently now she's trying to sue him because of the hot sauce hurting her virgin. Yeah, so it's a win-win for her, like. Like, what the fuck, like? Isn't that mental, like, that? Uh, like, first of all, for that to be a thing that, like, a woman would do that just to get pregnant by someone like Drake. Mm. And then it's obviously, it's a bit of a thing, like, in that, in those circles, if Drake knew enough to actually go and put the hot sauce in there so she wouldn't catch him. That's mental, like. No? It is a bit mad, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need you to say it for the recording if yeah. you're like you're being interviewed by the shit. Hey, that's crazy, Stooge. <laughs> yeah, that's fucked up, man. Imagine though, imagine yeah, living that great, kind of life. You'd be fucking famous, man. You'd be, I'd be well paranoid about that's that. That's what I'm shit, saying. Man. Imagine living that kind of life. You think it would be great, like, but nah. fuck me, you can't trust no one. Who's what the guy to give him the advice to put hot sauce in? I know, yeah. Some fucking weirdo. That's it, like, you know, it's obviously something that, like, it could have happened before because you always hear celebrities being told, like, Oh, I'm pregnant with your child, and they're like, "No fucking way, a hundred percent, blah blah blah." It's not mine. It's not mine. They deny it down to the ground. They seem really confident that it's not theirs, probably because they wore a condom, and like your one could have just done that. So maybe some rumor went around that someone got caught in that way before, like. Mm. So now they're all just putting in a bit of hot sauce and this and that. That's mental, though. They're fucking fifty cent, and the lads didn't just see him sharing memes like a packet of Jorex with Drake on the front of it and a bottle of hot sauce and shit. It was like uh, extra spicy fucking lubricant and all this shit. <laughs> Taking the piss out of Drake. Ah, oh, I guess. You can take a joke anyway. Yeah. And him the gas there, will you, Mike? What about Richard Gere stuck, sticking a gerbil up his arm? <laughs> that was years ago. Did you want to hear about that recently? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Is that Drake's kid, is it? Um, I have no idea who that is. He white. Does Drake have a kid? I don't know. This looks like a little blue-eyed white boy anyway with blonde hair, doesn't it? Baby Black Adonis. Features. Baby Adonis. Oh, he confirmed that Adonis, whom he shares with French pa- painter. Painter, yeah. Sophie, Sophie who was conceived after just one encounter. So this is his son. Yeah. All right, Jack. Adonis. Didn't even know he had a child. No. Fair play, Tim. Yeah, fucking... Why are we watching videos of Drake playing with a child all of a sudden? I know, yeah. I feel like, um... I was just trying to lighten doing, the Mikey? mood a bit here, like, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, Mikey? Mikey loves Drake. You're turning things weird, lad. Yeah. What was it you asked me about there a second ago, Mikey? <clears throat> oh, yeah, the Richard Gere thing. Yeah. You're like, what the fuck was the story with that? 90s, that was years man, yeah. ago, wasn't it? Yeah, I didn't even know if it was true. Mikey brought that up recently, and I was like, oh, no, yeah, there was a song about it, and I sent him the song of, um... Stephen Lynch. Stephen Lynch, yeah. yeah. Uh, singing a whole song about sticking a gerbil up his arse. Yeah. That's the thing though, isn't it? That people do that shit like. Fucking Richard Gere gerbil. When did it happen? It must happened back in the 90s, man, ah, as far as look, I know. This is only two years ago, anyway. A highly questionable cultural history of Richard Gere's ass gerbil. Are you shaking your leg or something? Mm. Feel it, boy. He's nervous. nervous. He's nervous. <laughs> <laughs> the rumour has endured for decades, becoming as deeply embedded in pop culture as the alleged gerbil itself. Yeah. Who would have thought Gear himself would come out of it looking so enlightened? Of course, you know the story. It's one of the most enduring celebrity rumors of all time. And while the rumors usually jump around from celebrity to celebrity, this particular tale is only ever related to one guy, Richard Gere. So... What, was it because he was involved in Scientology that Scientologists actually released that rumor and Dora? Oh, yeah. Why, did he... S- some people are saying he was a Did Scientologist he leave the church? Like, yeah, and... Like fucking, we're going to spread a rumor about you now. Ah, Sour stop. bastards, man. They're yeah. mental. They are stone vibe, they're mad. Fucking weird. Like they get people stalking you and everything once mm. you leave. And yeah, man. I love the I love the documentaries on them, man. What's his name? There's a good one. The BBC. Louis Theroux. Louis Theroux. Yeah. yeah. Man. They start stalking him then. They did. Yeah. They sent reporters, well, cameramen and all around following him. Like mm. they were like, we're going to make a documentary of you making a documentary for uh, of us and all this. <laughs> we're just trying to intimidate him. Mm. He was just like, okay, cool. We can give a fuck. He's very good, man. He's a brave bastard as well, isn't he? Yeah. I like his... The, um, the, 
the anti-Semitics, the fucking white supremacists. Mm. And he was there and he was he was at their backyard. And they were like, are you Jewish? Are you Jewish? And he was like, I, I'd rather not say no. Are you Jewish? Tell me no if you're Jewish. Man, if I was in his shoes, I would have shot myself. <laughs> I don't remember that now. Oh, and he is, no, is he? He's Jewish, yeah, yeah. Are you Jewish? Says so you're a fucking Jew. Oh, what do they call him? A spick. Spick. Spick, mm. I hear. I thought that's what they call, like, Hispanics, isn't it? Mm, Spick. Beaners. Yeah. <laughs> Beaners as well, yeah. What's his name? Calls it. Ah, oh, that fucking... Can't believe he scratched me. Rafla. Oh, oh Carlos Mencia. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Spicks. He, ca- he keeps talking about Mexicans and Spicks. I don't know. Maybe he was talking about Jews. I don't think... Ah, but he was fucking... He, he, was, he was talking about every race, man. Yeah, yeah. But he kept using that term Spicks. I thought he was talking about, like, Was Hispanics. it Spick or Kike, one of them? Oh, Kike is a Jewish thing, is it? Jews, yeah. Wops or what? Wops or Wops. Italians, is it? Wogs are Italian. No, Over w- in Australia. Wogs is anyone that's from around the Mediterranean is a wog. In Australia, anyway, wog was the Italians. Was it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What were the Irish? Legends. Yeah, fucking. Big penis, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in Ireland, big penis. Very big a bigger penis. Here yeah. in Australia, we have such a small penis. Such but you a Irish small guy. penis, mate. <laughs> big that joke Johnson. that you sent me on, man, that was very funny, man. It was an American fella. Oh, yeah. oh, this is my impression of an Australian at a job interview who forgot his portfolio. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're just going to have to look at your pirate file, they are. Yeah. Oh, oh no. no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I forgot my pirate file, they are. I forgot your pirate file, they are. <laughs> and I tried to do it then in an Australian accent. It's actually fucking hard. <laughs> it's very hard. Because you know what, like... We have 33 in a third, like... Yeah, in different mm-hmm. accents, you have, like, like Scottish. Like, it's very hard for them to say burglar alarm. Or purple. Or, or oh, purple, yeah. Or curly whirly. Curly whirly. Curly whirly. Purple. <laughs> Temple. Temple, yeah. Uh, yeah. I suppose that would be the Australian one. Portfolio. Which portfolio. <laughs> portfolio. 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 Yeah, the place has gone stone divine insane over there anyway at the moment, What's the story with Jocko? Did he get the other? He's going home, yeah. He's gone again. Is he gone home? Yeah. So he's not going to play in the Australian Open, so? Nah, fucking. Before fair or. He'll just, have to, to, he? he'll just have to play with his own balls. Yeah, uh-huh. sure he will. Yeah, that's fucking get like somebody else to play with him. He's the money for it. It's crazy, like isn't it? Like I think a lot of people have heard like that Australia has gone a bit mad or they're very strict. Like, but if you actually go and look at it properly, what's going on over there? It's fucking insane. Like, mm. they still have the army patrolling yeah. the streets in there. Yeah, the fucking armed police everywhere. They're arresting people in public for not wearing a mask, tackling people to the ground. There's pregnant. W- I saw a video of a pregnant woman being arrested in her house for posting something on social media about an upcoming <coughs> protest. She posted to say that there was a protest coming up and they came and arrested her and she was heavily pregnant. Like mm. She was in the video going, I have an ultrasound in an hour. What the fuck are you doing? Like Arrested her. There's people being dragged out of their house for all kinds of reasons. They're bringing them off to detention camps. They're building camps all over the place. It's fucking insane, man. There's some app as well that everyone has to have on them where they'll text you or something and you have to reply within a few minutes with a selfie and your location and if you don't they'll send the police out for you like from my location off best and of luck boys you have to scan in everywhere even to go to an off license now in western Australia you can't even go into an off license without um vaccine Affy. passport bottle shop bottle out bottle out yeah fucking hell like you can't go to the bottle and the yeah. arvo yeah. Like I've always said I missed him and you couldn't pay me to live down now. Nah, Jesus <laughs> Christ, it's insane. Like. I did love him when I was older, man, and I'd fucking, I'd, I've, I've always said I can't wait to go back, but no, after seeing that shit, man, I've no interest. Like. It's shocking, isn't it? Like, cause it? like the three of us lived there, yeah. you would never expect it to go that bad. It seemed very laid back and, mm. you know, ah, fuck the rest of the world, we're doing our own thing kind yeah. of a vibe. I'd never expected them to go so mental with this, like. Mm. It's fucking scary, like. It is fucking mad, man. It's crazy shit, man. Well, Just... I was uh, I was talking to one of the boys the other day, and he told me he's going to Prague and he's stag. Mm. And I said to him, I says, um, well, what's the story now in terms of fucking restrictions and stuff like that? And he said, man, there's zero over there. Yeah, everything's open. Strip clubs are open. Bars <laughs> are open. Don't need vaccine passports. I mean, the, the strictest they are is is with masks. Yeah. To wear masks in some places, but that's it. They're more or less back to normal. Like. That's the first thing we try to check their strip clubs off. <laughs> yeah. But this is what he said to me. Yeah. Like. <laughs> he is going and he's stag, like, so. Yeah. That's mad, isn't it? Man, it's, it's strange to think that it would be weird to be in a place now where all that stuff is gone. Mm. You know, it's just normal, everyday life, and that would be weird to us now at this stage. Mm. That's fucking insane, like. 
They said uh, the Taoiseach said anyway that they're, they're not going to make uh, vaccines mandatory in this mm. country. They better not try. It's far, oh, man. Jesus Christ. It's madness, man. Because I've I've a wedding now in Scotland, yeah, and I was talking to the the groom, and he was telling me that I was saying what the story is. What what's the story with me not being vaccinated? And he said that uh, right now. The law is that if you come in and you don't have a vaccination, you have to isolate for 10 days, man. And I'm a groomsman for this wedding. Oh, for fuck's sake. So, the wedding's not until June, I think, June or June, yeah. So, uh, you better hope things change July. before then. So, like, your only option then would be to go 10 days early and isolate. Yeah. Like, how or, does that work? Like, Or, or expose myself to COVID and get a, and get a, get a recovery, get a recovery passport. Will that do you, like? I don't know how the fuck. Man, I'd have to look into it more. Like, <clears throat> I know what the story is. I seem to be immune to the bastard, though. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. Like, yeah, that's it. Like, but that's it. Like, you could be immune to it, or you might have got it before, and like, you're asymptomatic. Yeah, because like a lot of people have gotten it right around you now, like, and you never picked it up. So, yeah, yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> Strange one. My nephew has it, man. Yeah, He's seven. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, like in the last while, like my my two bro- two of my brothers got it, my mother got it, um, and then just loads of other people that I know, like, but mm. not a bother on any of them, like, like the worst, the worst that any of them had was a sore throat, that was it, like this new Omicron fucking variant is meant to be just, it's all in the throat, like you just have a sore throat with a bit of a cough and that's about it, like. And they're making it out to be fucking it's yeah. killing people left, right, and centre. Yeah, it's a nine of shit out of me that all the professionals out there are saying like this is like this the weakest variant. It's highly transmissible, but it's very weak. Like, and then the government are like, "Oh, this new Omicron poses serious threats. It's ripping through countries." They're like, what the fuck is it doing though? Nothing. They're like, "How many people has been hospitalised from it?" Um, none. It like, sounds like okay. it's a transformer or something. Like yeah. Yeah, Omicron. Omicron. <laughs> fuck off. Yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> Didn't really want to be talking about COVID and shit anyway in the first episode back. Ripped off mm. YouTube. Bastard of a yuck. Yeah, I know. That's the thing as well, man. They're censoring everything then. Your man, sure, fucking Joe Dr. Robert, Robert Malone, mm. fellow who invented the technology behind these vaccines, he wasn't allowed to talk about it. They took him off Twitter. Fuck off. Yeah, they banned him off Twitter. Jesus Christ. For saying that the vaccines are dangerous, like. I think the point he was trying to make was that if you keep going with these boosters, like, and topping it up every few months, it becomes very dangerous. It becomes more and more dangerous the more you do that, like. This is the man who invented this shit, like, and, well, he was one of the inventors <laughs> anyway, mm. you know, and he's told, shut up, you're not allowed to talk about it. Like, what? Who the fuck is allowed to talk about it then? Mm. Some fucking idiot in the government who has no idea what a spike protein is, do you know what I mean? Mm. Telling us what we should be doing. Ah, oh, man, the whole world has gone insane, like, insane. Up the rah, isn't it? Yeah. All you can do is just sit back and laugh at him, like. Man, yeah, even, just... if, like, even if I'm driving to work knowing it's on the radio, man, I'll turn the radio off. Sick yeah, I'm the same. Yeah, man. you're it's just non stop. You're being bombarded with it all the time. That's oh, why I didn't want to talk about news. it. <laughs> it's still around, man. I think it's going to be around for a long time. So just mm. get on with your life. Like, that's the only thing you can do now is just get on with it. Like, do you know what I mean? Simple as like this yeah. business. Is I don't trying think to there's fucking... any fucking beating it. Like, no, nah, but it's not even that, man. It's like it's not something that's even more beating at this stage. Like, just forget about it. Like, we, we're not making this big deal out of the fucking seasonal flu that comes around every year. Yeah, we yeah. just live our lives. We live with it. Oh, if you get it, you feel shit for a few days and you're grand again. Same thing with this, like, obviously, in extremely fucking rare cases, some people get fucked up by it, but there's more and more people getting fucked up by the vaccine than there is by this fucking thing. Yeah. Do you know, so, oh, man. Anyway, like we were just saying, it's everywhere, so I didn't really want to be talking about it on this. Yeah, 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 people yeah. were like, oh, here's a bit of old something different, and then we start talking about it. Uh, we're only talking about it because it's fucking everywhere. Yeah, it's a nine. Like, it's hard know? to avoid it. Like. Uh, it's very annoying to it. It's just non-stop on the radio like and non-stop on the telly and yeah. they're trying to make out like fucking getting the vaccine. It's all cool. <laughs> like, it's fuck off, shit. man. Yeah. I will not be taking any vaccine anyway. They can do what they want. Wow. They can make it mandatory all they want and they can find me or try to do this, that and the other thing like is I'm not taking it like and that I'll go into I'll talk about why I won't take it some other time but I want to be taking up the whole episode talking about that but mm. Well, yeah. Boris has been at parties. Yeah, Boris, yeah. Again, gas buys, huh? Yeah. There was no party in number 10, remember? And now here's another one. Footage of Boris Johnson disco dancing disco becomes dance? massive online hit as flood of memes over Downing Street party scandal continues. Boris Johnson is on the dance floor. You heard that dry right. A bureau with a fucking lightsaber. Yeah. 
And a big Illuminati floor, then, you know, the floor. That's the old, um, do you know that floor, Mikey? Black no. and white checkered pattern. That's no. the old um, Freemason fucking floor, like, as well. Uh, if you know about That's these old um, rituals and shit that they're into, they're always done on this floor. <laughs> Boris is just an embarrassment, boy, isn't he? Like, how was he? Like, what was the thing I saw a meme there recently? It was like, um, the difference between an animals and humans is that animals would never let the dumbest among them lead them. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> what the fuck? Like, Should when you see people like him and Trump and shit in power, and they're like, what? People, I like Trump, though, man. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> people say that, like, um, people that used to work with Boris, like, their, his advisors and everything, he said, they said, like, um, he used to always mess his hair up before he'd go out on, on television, on yeah. an interview or everything. Cause yeah. It would be great if he just scruffy, passed yeah. away. On purpose, yeah. yeah. Maybe he wants people to underestimate him or something. Yeah, they want him to think they're a, he's a bumbling idiot or whatever. Yeah, yeah. But, um, he, said, he could be just a genius behind like, it all. He has kids with three or four different women. Like, and there's well, loads yeah. of weird shit about him. Bit like, of a whore right, master, right isn't that, Yeah, that's it. You look at him and you'd be like, poor bastard's probably a virgin. But he's with a young one then or something, isn't he? Yeah, he's <laughs> you know with a I mean? blonde American one. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's with some young one. Looks, I, I can't yeah. remember, but I'm what fairly sure she's, she's American. Is that her? No, it's not her. That's not her anyway. That's someone I remember her from something else. You're the one in behind racking up lines. Yeah, look up his missus. It's like, what the fuck? Like, how in the name of God? Did you ever see Power, the? Man. Did you ever sexy, see the? That's it. it. Uh, did you ever see the? Was Why'd it a picture of him? Why did you have the caps lock on, Mikey? What? Why did you have the caps lock on? Mike, I want to shout it into fucking Google. <laughs> Mikey's like, go, girl, show me a picture. Carrie Johnson, fucking. Yeah, Do you know what I mean? Like, she what? gets up on that. Uh, base. <laughs> Watch the moat in him. He has a moat like a vandalized graveyard. Then, yeah. Oh yeah, give it to me. Oh, oh. oh forgive he's a me. Moat like a oh, finished oh. game. I guess, oh. <laughs> when he's done after ten seconds, he's like, "Forgive oh, me. Oh, yeah. forgive me." Did you see that um, speech, Mikey? Oh. Did you see that speech? No. Nah? Yeah. Ah, you didn't see it. Jesus Christ, man! They took the piss out of him everywhere over it. It was only a few weeks ago. He was giving some speech somewhere, a really important speech, and he just completely fumbled and forgot where he was, and he was <coughs> going through all these papers. Oh, forgive me. Uh uh, forgive me uh, uh, and then he puts it down and he's like uh, has, has anyone been to Peppa Pig World and just started talking about Peppa Pig for about five minutes shout out to Walsh unit yeah uh -huh. he was just completely lost where he was and then just started talking about Peppa Pig and shit for a few minutes and it was just like what the fuck they asked him about it afterwards and he was like oh, I think it went quite well they seemed to like it and we're like you did not talk a lot of bollocks mm. did you ever see the picture of him out running I think he's wearing like a shirt and a pair of shoes and a short pants or something. And tape over his nipples so they're on chair. <laughs> Duck tape. Because he's got big nipples. That first one there, Mikey, yeah. Ah, stop. Watch the fucking... Forget <laughs> he's quiff flapping. He's just he's wearing a white shirt like he's, he's wearing a white shirt and he's wearing shoes like. You can't see his shoes properly. To Click mines. the ones below that, see if you can get his feet. Get every one of his feet into the picture. Ah, so below that, then it looks like he's running with Yeah, there. <laughs> he's wearing a shirt, a white shirt, short pants, black socks, and black shoes. And he's out for a jog. Was this some, um, was it like a charity run or something going on? He probably joined in for the last two meters or something. No, I'd say his fucking coke dealers around the corner. <laughs> he's probably off his face. Jog on 90. He beats his wife. <laughs> Jesus Christ. He looks like somebody who beats his I was wife, just thinking it? the same thing. Mm. I just didn't want to say it on, on, on the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake. I don't know, man. He's a mad character. He doesn't give a bollocks then either. Like, even when he fucks things up, he's like, mm. Watch him there. Ah, stop. He's out again, running. Is he actually into the old running? Because he doesn't look like he's into the old running. No. There's a lot of pictures of him there running, like, for a fella who's fucking... Some pair of ditties. <laughs> yeah. <you know? laughs> He just likes to go bouncing his ditties around the place. Yeah, yeah. That's this what he really paparazzi. likes. Uh, wow, well, man. He's a vile cunt, isn't he? He is, man. Be honest him now. Have you to give him like... over in his house now need a fry in front of you. Would you wear it? <laughs> <laughs> I would never be in his house in the first place. You would, man. Fuck him. Why would you be passed out in his house in the first place? Mm. Uh, Roofie. Probably got invited to one of his parties. Roofling is a hell of a drug. Yeah. Is that what it's called? Roofling? Roofling, yeah. Rohypnol. Rohypnol, yeah, what the fuck am I on about? What the fuck is Rufalin? Oh yeah, Rufi is just a... It's a nickname of, 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 of Rohypnol, isn't it? That's what okay, I'm thinking, I'd say you're shaking is, the yeah. cameraman. Shaking the, the whole floor. 
I'm probably nervous. Like, I'm probably Leave like this. <laughs> Fucking. Yeah, I don't know. There's ruffle in a real thing now. Don't Google it, Mikey. The door kicked in. <laughs> Imagine it. <laughs> <laughs> ah, boys. Yeah, I don't know, man. A lot of shit. Did you see fucking, what's his, what's his name as well? Um, Machine Gun Kelly. Got engaged. Yeah. To fucking Megan Fox. Yeah. What is but going on in the what world? they did after that? They drank each other's blood, apparently. Yeah, because like, they're vampires. What the fuck, like? First of all, I don't know, like, what is it with celebrities, like, that they have to go all out Mental. there and do stupid shit like that? And then, what the fuck happened to fucking Machine Gun Kelly? Remember him years ago, Mikey? Yeah. We used to listen to him back fucking 10 years ago. More, even. And he was fucking like, he was a savage rapper, like. And he used to just, he used to kind of dress like a bit of an old punk rock fella or something, a little bit. But he was fucking very good rapper, like, he had a few good tunes out. And then all of a sudden, man, he turns up to the fucking MTV Awards looking like something like a fucking. I, I don't even know. I don't have a was word from him. Did you see him? Or something like that, nah, he? he was there with um, Megan Fox. Like, he looked like someone walking for Foot Locker who got her size. In, in the back room that's what they were saying like <laughs> yeah. memes or this picture of him kneeling in front of her like in this fucking black and white striped short oh was that him yeah yeah I saw that I didn't realise it was him or something like. was that, that, was, that, that was the same night that McGregor went for him was it uh no she bet shit what was McGregor. it I don't know actually was it oh I think it was the same night yeah look at the state but of like, him, man what the fuck happened here? It like? looks like Macaulay Culkin never gave up the other one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just changed completely. He's gone pure fucking weird. Like, he had all at the MTV Awards, he had all these like diamond things like stuck on his face all around. And <laughs> I saw that, yeah. It's like, what the fuck, it was man? It's a fucking lucky bag ring he gave her then. Like, yeah. Jesus. Yeah, crazy. disgusting. A green one. Green stone and a white stone. Yeah, Machine Gun Kelly and Megan Fox got engaged, then drank each other's blood. Did they, though? They're probably just saying that. <sighs> I made a marriage proposal under a banyan tr- tree. What does that mean? What's the Where's this? Oh, under a under a banyan tree. Yeah. I don't know what's a banyan tree. It's just yeah, you're know. after touching on something. Click on the click there. Yeah. No. The menu is after dropping down over the whole story. Now you can't see it. Shit website. Can't. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe do a scroll or something. Yeah, yeah I don't you know what. Up, uh, you're after fucking up. Yeah, it's my first time. The Broke the internet again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the fuck a banyan tree is. You got engaged under a tree or something anyway. Mm. But is whatever about that. that. Any more special, like? Yeah. Drinking each other's blood, though. That makes it more special. <laughs> What's the point of that, like? Yeah, set a great agreement by drinking each other's blood. But, like. She got so much work done, it says she melted and she cried. <laughs> She's what, four years older than him or something, is she? She? I think so. In my age anyway, yeah. Stead of him though, like, Jesus Christ. This, I don't know, man, I just I, can't get over how someone changed that much, like. We all had a med wank to her now in the first Transformers movie, in fairness. Four no? <laughs> myself a Sunder. Sunder, stop. 2008. 2008, if you got that right now, you're a weirdo. It Was it 2008? 2008 the how the fuck do you know these Five things? minutes, 12 seconds in. There's a lot of people at home going, yeah. That scene when she had the... She had the fucking bonnet of the car open. Man. <laughs> Man. Fox. I tell you, it wasn't a stipple ceiling when I walked in, but it was a stipple ceiling when I came out. <laughs> that was uh, a semen joke. You're an people, uh, <laughs> That was an ejaculant yeah, joke. I had my penis directed at the ceiling. <laughs> if you're a plasterer that wanks a lot, you'll get that joke. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. What about you with your pig heart fucking story, you know? Yeah, that's fucking mental. Like, they're after, um, they're after performing the first pig to human heart transplant. They transplanted, but you see how they did it? They fucking, they took a pig's heart and they basically just altered the genes in the heart. Yeah. They, re- they removed a few pig genes and inserted a few human genes and then put it in this man's body and he's grand. He has a pig's heart now. How long is he alive? Is he still alive? He's still alive, yeah. When was this performed? Um, I don't know. Recently, anyway. I only just saw the story the other night. Um, where's it gone? The chance to survive. In 2021, surgeons at New York. The 7th of uh, January operation will further. 7th of January. 
Yeah, the, I think like the first the they took like a, a bit a bit of a valve or something from a pig's heart and put it into him, and then after a while that started failing or something. So they were like, "We'll do the whole heart." They just genetically modified a pig's heart to make it work in a human. It's crazy, bro. That's madness. They just need to put a bit of a bear in him now, and then you know what's going to happen. Mm. He'd be super serious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you're a South Park fan, you'll get that one. He would become man bear pig, half man, half bear, half, half pig. pig. Obviously. Excelsior. Excelsior. Everyone's super stoked on him right now. <laughs> <laughs> they just don't know it yet. And their pig is real. Uh-huh. Sucks <laughs> for you. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, there isn't an awful lot really going on in the news, lads, is there now? No, to be fair. Sure this is our first, pod- pod- that that first podcast first in a podcast small podcast while. In, yeah, in a small while, so we're just kind of winging it. Yeah. We'll be back it. next week with more. Wanging it then. Hopefully. Mm. Do you have to knock the old dust off there with this one? Mm. Very strange, man. I was here last night, myself and Mikey, just trying to set everything up. I said I'd come in and do an old sound check. Hooked everything up. Fuck all worked. Fuck off. <laughs> I was just like, what the fuck? None of the cameras worked, should have not Mikey? No, no. Took me ages, man. I was like, why? What are you here for? Um, Three days. Well, about nine hours, I'd say. Myself and Mikey were here till the wee hours of the morning. like Wee? Yeah, the wee hours now. Are you being serious? Nah, we're here for a while anyway. We're just fucking Why didn't you just answer the question properly? So <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how long we're here. Two, three hours? Probably about two hours, is that? Yeah, about two hours there. That's way less than nine hours, man. Why would you lie to me? I'm your best friend. I know, yeah, but still, that's why I lie to you. I suppose, yeah. You, you like know? to protect my feelings. Exactly. You have to... Yeah, you have to, to lie. protect it's the ones just around me. Lies. It's not going to hurt anybody. I have to tell lies to protect her. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, like Batman, basically. Yeah, yeah. So, like like, like I wouldn't tell you now if I was Batman because yeah. like I wouldn't Batman want nothing to happen approach. to you. I wouldn't want no one to be taking no wind and trying to get a few quid off me. Like, mm. do you know what I mean? I would say nothing. Mm. But yeah, Soft fucking um, plugged um, plugged everything in. Fuck yeah. Plug it to Plugged just... it in. You know, I, was like, I was like that, look. Yeah. Slipping it in, like. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No lube, fuck all. Just straight in. No straight kissing. Straight in, no kissing, yeah. Just bang. straight in. How's your daddy? Plugged everything in. And yeah, cameras wouldn't work. Eventually figured that out. Tara had everything. Well, else? The headphones weren't working at one stage. And then. Yeah. Fucking hell. Had no snare on my headphones. Yeah, Mikey was fucking roaring and shouting. He'd no mm. snare on his headphones. So I had to fix that. <clears throat> then when I thought I had everything sorted. Forgot about Mikey's um, microphone and headphones over there. None of them were working either. None of them. <laughs> so eventually I got Mikey's headphones and... I have to do a confession here. Wow. I did all of this just to test you. Yeah, bastard. Mikey snuck in when I wasn't here and just fucking changed everything around. Like, see if he still got it. Bad bastard. And then when I, you know, when I got it all done, then he looked at me and he goes, son of a bitch, I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> We're coming back for one more podcast. When you got it all done, he went bond. I was James like, I bond. think that's it, Mikey. And he was like, you son of a bitch, I'm in. I'll have what she's having. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's just been revoked. Yeah. <laughs> Frankly, Mikey, I don't give a damn. <laughs> Why can't I think of one? I can't even think of one of them. I'll be Sicking back. with myself. Dude, I'll where's be back. my car? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm uh, Batman. The only way for me to solve this crisis is to be Superman 4, the quest for <laughs> peace. <laughs> oh, uh, lads. Guys, talking random nonsense. Sure, Missed that. Of... Missed talking absolute nonsense, no fairness. <clears throat> yeah, man. Like I said, no, it's the first podcast in a while, so I didn't know what to expect, so I was slightly yeah. nervous. So I apologize for not being very vocal in this one. Just, um... I'll go mental next week. Bring the mic down, smile a bit. I fucking won't. <laughs> <laughs> You're Tell not me, the boss of me, you uh, wanker. Telling me what to do, though. Yeah, yeah. Money we'll help. Just... Money giving you a bit of advice. Yeah. Trying to help you out. A bit of advice now. Huh? Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best uh, advice you'll ever get. Fuck off, my yeah. Did your father ever tell you to fuck off, my I was just going to say, <laughs> what is going on? Yes, I need to give up them drugs. I was just going to say, I'll tell you what my father taught me when I was in flat. Fuck out, don't come back. Yeah. Uh, Bend over and take it like a man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah, lad. Yeah. Ah, oh, in all fairness, though, my father is a great kisser. He is, very. He's tickly mustache, though. Oh, tickly stop. mustache. Yeah. No sense. Tickly Will not shave well. it. Will not shave it, no matter what. No. Deadly. He's right, too. Proper man's man, like, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But you're beaming with life anyway, driving these days, yeah. flying around the roads. It just makes life a lot Legally. easier, man. Yeah. A lot, and I, like, like I told you last week, it was like the, the only, one of the main reasons why I, I wouldn't get on the road in the first place is just 
what if the car breaks down? It's all money like yeah. this, but fucking like none of that has happened yet. Mm. And whatever's happened was only cheap things like. Yeah, but sure, you're grand now anyway. Like. Do you know what I mean? And I fuck, I'm fucking making serious money now as well yeah, like, with so. the van. So. Not a main. Nice one. All works wing. out. All works out, man. All works out in the end, huh? Yeah. And all I had to do was stop taking heroin. All I had to do was just. You only just had to do one thing. Stop taking heroin and cocaine and drinking all the time and <laughs> robbing people. <laughs> <laughs> just that's just that one little over thing. In the subway. <laughs> the subway there in O'Connell Street. Yeah, yeah. fucking oh, throwing shopping trolleys into the Shannon as well. Ah oh, man, yeah, yeah. Will, yeah. fucking can't be deadly boy. It's amazing how changing that one little thing just started stop lighting bags. Like. Stop lighting bags of shit in people's front door and running the, <laughs> run the bell, ringing the bell. And then Thank when they come man. out and knocking them out with a baseball bat. <laughs> <laughs> like, what was the point of the flaming bag of shit? Ah, that was just, just to, to throw them off. <laughs> 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 it was just to throw them off the scent. Just like lighting bags of shit. Shut up about it. Yeah. Why are you asking so many questions? Fucking hell, it's nearly an hour already, man. Is that? Yeah. Time are we? We've ten minutes to wait, Mike. We've gone about oh, 50 boy. minutes, boys. That's Jesus, Jude is timing us, boys. Fucking right. We're just after about, about 10 seconds. Lads. Madness, man. Somebody's to talk shit in fairness, yeah. Uh, that's what I love about the podcast as well, man. You could just you could be on a topic and then you just yeah. ramble off and you'd be gone for about a half an hour. Yeah. Up my right. That's what used to <laughs> <laughs> That's what used to happen. Um Up Rory. A lot like I could have I could have a lot of fucking uh topics there. Up, <laughs> <laughs> up Rory, you said was it? Shout out to the boys in Brody. <laughs> <laughs> one for the boys in Brody. Shout out the to the boys in Brody house. Drinking trying cans be- Trying to better their lives <laughs> Oh that's out there is it? No nah, no. That, that's in Kilmallock It's a different place Brody House Bro- is in Brody, Brody House. Man, yeah. Yeah, for, Is where, it? Where yeah. did you get the kayak? What's the place I'm thinking of then? What? Where did you get the kayak Jude? Uh, <laughs> Jude bought a kayak oh, yeah. Posh cunt Bought a kayak yeah When you don't use and you don't drink This is what you can do You can buy cars And then you can buy a kayak To boat. go on top of the car You bought a board as well water. Basically I bought a board basically See the way your man had a helicopter On top of his board He would have a board on top of your car <laughs> You know what I mean <laughs> Jeff Bezos Yeah And the patch on you boy No And turn oh, the board upside down be So it's climbing. more aerodynamic All the money he has Do you think he'd get a hair transplant <laughs> he, sent, he sent himself to space in a rocket What are you going to do to match that oh. Just make a big fox And fire yourself up to my ass Down to river that Anish Lumina <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop uh, ganging up me boys I'm nervous <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake Oh fucking hell Who should we have in the podcast next week? <laughs> Willie O'D yeah. Willie O'D Bring him in and just Lash the head off him <laughs> <laughs> And shave his moustache And then keep it and kill him Bring out a politician Willie, Stop fucking Starting fights with people and Ah yeah Did you see that video? Cheeky cunt like Who was this? <laughs> Willie O'D scrapping and down yeah. <laughs> Did you not see that? Nah Oh man So what you say about my moustache you cunt? <laughs> <laughs> nah, fucking um, so it sounded like some girls in the car got the video or something. They were yeah. roaring, laughing. Yeah. Willie O'Day, nah, Willie O'Day was walking down the road, no, fucking steps, drunk, like. And you uh, one of those shoes with a knife that comes out of the fucking shoe <laughs> and, and you kick your man in the butt. <laughs> Double or seven shoes. Yeah, <laughs> Mikey getting carried away. Uh, <laughs> 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 nah, I swear to God, he already didn't believe the story. That's Mikey didn't bet it a thousand times away. more. You see if we can get it up, Mikey, because I don't believe this shit at all. Not my Willie O'Dea, <laughs> not my saviour. See, see if we can get it up. Huh? He's, a the neck, yeah, He's a tick neck now, in fairness to him. He has, yeah. Russell will tell you he is. Willie O'Dea with the tick neck. Um, he was walking down the road anyway, drunk, I, I, and he I, I, fell, and lads tried to pick him up. And he got it? up and he gave your man yeah. a connector. <laughs> your man was like, I fucking tried to help you, man. I'm helping you up. And he was like, oh, is that all right? Well, we, we'll leave it at that. So, and I'll listen. And she was shaking her hand's hand. I was like, so what the fell fuck? with him, like, a, protecting him or something, did he? Or was that yeah, I don't know. He's been doing a great job protecting him. There was him someone with him, all right. right. Um, ah, fuck. Where'll I get that video? <laughs> someone else released it. a video of him, of this fucking James Bond clip. Did you ever see that? No. It was just this fella rubbing a cat and some woman, like, oh, some oh, day oh, with yeah. James Bond film. And she walks over this bridge where there's piranhas or something in the water. And she drops into the water and gets hit by the piranhas. <laughs> and the, 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 the picture flicks back to Willie O'Dea stroking <laughs> a cat. Then, I did this see is my favourite kitty cat here now. <laughs> <laughs> I did see uh, that. Willie O'Dea, the man with the dash. The man yeah. with the dash and the man with the dash and hash. Dash and hash. Ah, uh, boys. You're not going to try it up, Mike. You're going to try. I don't think it's. That was a Snapchat thing. Yeah, it was, was a Snapchat it? thing. Sure, that got sent around on phones. Like, we'll definitely have it. I have it on my phone anyway from when Mikey sent it to me. Yeah, because I would not delete that. Like, <laughs> this is there somewhere. I'll find yeah. it. But, uh, yeah, that was it. Like, he gave your man a, a fucking connector. And then 
shook his hand. I was like, oh, sorry about that. Yeah, here's a tissue there for your fucking broken so. nose. And then you walked off like, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> he said, go home, fuck, <coughs> clean yourself up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, fuck your mother. What, Take it, what your are you going to do, like cry about it? fucking man, right? Yeah. You fucking pussy, Willie said. <laughs> Gas, come boy. Old Willie, huh? <laughs> um, Will and Muddy. Yeah, if you, were, you, if you were in me? that situation now, would you sue him? Yeah. Yeah. Well, everything is God. I take that tassel off. I, I was thinking about that at the time because I was like, usually, like if you get into a scrap or whatever, you get into a scrap, you just draw, oh, forget about it or whatever. Like, mm. but if it's a politician, you know well, if you went down the road and hit a politician, they're gonna do you like they're gonna oh, want course, to see man, you yeah. locked up. They're gonna want to sue you. They're gonna want all this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So yeah. if it were if it was the other way around and a politician assaulted you, you'd have to think about it, wouldn't you? I hate, I hate doing all that kind of thing. Well, like, but wear a dildo off his head. You'd <laughs> <laughs> be cock mark on his forehead. Then. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of that, Willie? Yeah. Willie. Wh- Willie, Willie, old Willie, Willie forehead, huh? Willie forehead. Willie or Robert Willie or D. <laughs> Fucking hell. And the poor man only tried to help him. Will he give me a connector? <laughs> yeah. For fuck's sake. I don't know what happened. He did knuckle dust in, in his hand. Like, that was no a fucking coincidence. Like, you know what I mean? Jesus <laughs> Christ, man. Uh, <laughs> Mike is just trying to make him sound worse. Like, he got up and he had all this white powder under his nose, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and he had a knuckle dust on. And your man I said to him. smell the weed through the camera. <laughs> your man said to him, please, I have kids, I have a family. And Willie was like, I don't give a fuck give a about, fuck your, family. about <laughs> your family. I'm going after them when they kill you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Huh? I'm going to make you watch. How old's your son? Two and a half. He's old enough for <laughs> baiting. He <laughs> <laughs> only walks off then into the fucking moonlight. <laughs> so yeah. Trench coat on. <laughs> Trust is the joker. You want to know how I got this tash? <laughs> <laughs> I was born with it. Yeah. Wow. And really that's the only place for some I reason. I was born in it. <laughs> down the island. You think the tash is your friend? <laughs> <laughs> you merely adopted the tash. Yeah. I was born with it. Molded oh, by it. Kiltili. You from Kiltili? I didn't see a Mac tree until I was already a man. Fucking <laughs> 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 uh, Willie, huh? What can you do for me, huh? The man with the tash. And Fuck that's his man. trademark. Yeah. You'll never see him without that tash. Yeah. Man. Oh, boys, he could shave his tash tomorrow and walk down the road. No one would know him. No. He'd be like, lad, South Island there. I thought it was Willie O'Dea, but he had no tash, though. It couldn't no, have been Willie O'Dea. Like. <laughs> you don't fuck with the minister, the former, <coughs> former minister for defence. Like, yeah. He's the minister himself. for gay, man. He's fucking posing with guns and all on the internet, the mad cunt. Yeah. Huh? Wonder would we get a man for the laugh? He'd never come on. First thing I'd ask him anyway is, what is politics? Yeah. That's what I'd ask him. They'd be like, I don't know what politics Define is. Define politics. Explain it. Yeah, explain what, it. What yeah. do you do? Yeah. Exactly. And then he'll go off on a big rant about Peppa Pig World. What do you do besides going around promising people things yeah. and then not giving them them things? Yeah. yeah. What do you do other than that? Well, what do you do with the votes you get from the fake promises of people? <laughs> How do we know them votes are real? Who counts them? Yeah. Can I be there when you're counting them? I'm really good at counting. You can trust me. <laughs> you can trust me, Willie O'D. <laughs> How many guards did you pay off? Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jesus. What about that dead hooker in your hotel room? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about that poor man that you knocked out with a black eye? Where's his money? <laughs> Where's his council house, Willie? How many oh, bodies yourself? are buried up in Cracklow Woods because of you? <laughs> yeah. Where's your real wife, Willie? Where's your what secret you family, one? One, Willie? <laughs> yeah. What's what that smell? Where's your secret family? <laughs> 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 oh, oh man stop. that mental that there's people out there doing that crack as well like mm. that have secret families now like Jesus Christ yeah. 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 maybe it'd be a good tele- television Imagine. reality show wouldn't it <laughs> the secret millionaire the secret <laughs> husband yeah. Nick the secret sneaky family. Willie O'D is a secret <laughs> family Joseph Fritzel <laughs> here's my family <laughs> opens up the basement door and she dead <laughs> <laughs> this is huh? my wife it's not important yeah. <laughs> <laughs> have a new wife. Yeah. The mind of butterflies. The mind. The mind. The, the mind of flies. The grand butterflies. Why is I not with it? Man. <laughs> My God. I need a fucking bottle of butterflies or something. Not nah, at all. Last thing you need. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> you just touch your nipples there. Good crack, yeah. Good yeah. crack. That's about yeah, it, man. boys. That's how we got in the hour. Yeah, that's, that's about it, is it? That'll yeah, do, that'll do. How do I even sign off? I can't even fucking remember what I used to say at the end of them. Totally like, I'm, I'm like, just going to say goodbye for this week. because I Two infinity and beyond or something. What? Two infinity and beyond or something. Was yeah, that my catch yeah, yeah, yeah. Lads, I thought it was someone else. No. I don't even have a catch That I should get a catch shouldn't I? Schmickles. Ain't I pretty? Schmickles. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake. Um, yeah. 
Um, apologies for the big massive break anyway for the last while. It was never meant to be that long. We were uh, worried about getting arrested and locked up there for a while. And um, yeah, well, it just... paid for the legal fees and we got yeah. it sorted out. And yeah. that was this it. is it. Say no more. Mikey knows a few people. Yeah. And uh, Mikey's yeah. involved in a illegal cockfighting scheme there. What's going on? <laughs> We're making a few quid off that. Yeah, yeah. Handy. Handy. We won't say anything about that though. Now, when we say cockfighting, we mean two men with their pants down and having erections. Like, yeah. Crossing just swords, whacking their penises. Going at it like. Mm. Yeah, Mikey, Mikey has won most of them because his cock is so small they can't get it. <laughs> <laughs> My cock's going to be preserved in a shot glass. <laughs> ah, Jesus, shot glass. But um, yeah, we're back anyway. That's the main thing, no? Yeah, yeah. We're back. That's the main thing. We're back and we're selling Dust two off microphones the old, uh, as well. What? <laughs> we're selling two microphones. <laughs> we're selling two microphones. If anyone wants to buy two microphones, because it's just going to be me and Jode and Mikey. And we're just going to fucking and Maybe with your D But I don't know What he's going to say about it After seeing this podcast <laughs> uh, We're only joking about All that stuff Will you can come on for the laugh yeah. Imagine doing that though Man just I'd have no me. interest in that Having a serious interview With someone like a politician and Of course just... you would man You can snare the bollocks off them. They're coming here for Yeah nothing. but that's what and I'm saying I can't, can't leave then Because we'll lock the door <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You know what I mean And those cameras are mobile Like you could pick yeah. them up And follow them down the stairs yeah, Now you've cable true. ties and handcuffs like, So what's the fucking yeah. problem here like? yeah. And Jesus if you Yeah if you, if I wouldn't you... mind I wouldn't mind something like that But I'm saying like A serious interview We have to actually ask them Proper questions now mm. I'd be bored like Do you know what I mean mm. Bring him in and slag the bollocks Out of him alright <laughs> Let's imagine we actually did that for a laugh. Well, Willie, he'd be like, I'm not signing any release forms. He'd be like, didn't ask you to, Willie, fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> That's in my head, like, like you know, those are right. Photoshop pictures of him or something, like riding pigs or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Willie'd be like, if you put up that, if you put that up online, I'll sue you. I'd be like, do you want to watch this video on my phone if you're giving a fella a dig on a candle street? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this will go live. Oh, uh, let's go on, sure. Yeah. I'm hungry. <laughs> uh, so obviously we're not allowed to go anywhere for anything to eat because we're not vaccinated and this is I'd say Castle Lovers wouldn't give a bollocks oh they do they're checking sorts are they? yeah they're checking sorts the bastards are they? they're asking mm. for ID? I don't know that's it who knows why do you think he's great now because he's vaccinated yeah oh yeah Mikey's yeah. vaccinated he took the soap yeah, yeah. I wake up screaming at night time yeah, but, but apart from that, I'm all right. Like, <laughs> apart from that, things are going pretty smooth. Yeah. <laughs> Mikey looking all frazzled over in the corner, yeah. <laughs> looking about 15 years older since last year. <laughs> like, yeah, it's been going, it's been going great, you know. He developed progeria there, load of normal Just rattling. Like forward, <laughs> yeah. uh, we we'll wrap it up a while. Yeah, we'll wrap it up there, sure, and we'll be back next week, and hopefully, we'll have some bit of a clue what we're doing in at that stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll actually yeah. bring topics. Bye Get a bit everybody. settled in. Good luck. Take Total it easy. Pips. Fine. Step back, Mike. We get a gander.